producto de desarrollo de esta manera. What's going on guys? It's Alimek. After I saw you guys enjoyed my Q&A video, I thought about showing you guys another daily video. So I'm here now. It is a European fair for advanced machine tools and advanced factories. Let's go inside and check it out. Alright, we got the business pass. Let's go inside. Oh no. Alright, first of all, we're gonna go to hole 7, advanced machines, and then hole 6, advanced factories. Let's go. Zero point zero eight. But it's very good. Yes. It's enough. It's enough for this kind of purpose. And whether marking for aesthetic purpose or okay. that in automotive industry, it's either aesthetic or it's more for testability. In this case, you can put. You have a marking area of six hundred by one hundred millimeter with a standard focal length. So you can put many parts on the table and mark them all in the same cycle. Uh, in this configuration, you can see you also have a vision system, so you can, if you don't have a, a fixture that is blocking the part right in position, you can also center the marking with the vision system. And if you mark a code code, you can also read and grade the code, the code, so you can check if it is a grade A, grade B, you can understand. So the paint has to be different kind of paint or it will work on any kind of paint? No, any kind of paint. Let's say you, the only thing is that with plastic you don't know in advance what kind of laser you, you need to use. Oh. So we must do the testing. It's a free service that we offer just to identify the source. And then from there you can define the kind of, the kind of machine. So you have the source and then the machine. Ah, it's okay. a combination of two elements. Uh, okay, another in question. Uh, so on black you can paint. Uh, white you can produce white uh, and yeah. on white it you will do, be black. You do black. No yeah. other choices, right? Exactly. Let's say on plastic is this. On metal is different. Let's say you have more some metal, some material like um, stain, uh, IEC 316, 304. You can produce also colors. Oh, okay. But this, let's say I can show you some examples. Okay, let's see. Oh, uh, these are the colors, right? Yeah. Mm. Nice. 
This kind of laser that is a, a kind of feather laser with adjustable pulse duration. Mm -hmm. So respect to the standard one, you can modulate the pulse duration, you can achieve these efforts on the metal and also be more versatile than the plastic. So if you want to work both plastic and metal, fiber laser is the one that can combine both. Oh, the only okay. thing is that on plastic, you must check how the plastics react to that wavelength. So oh. it's only a matter of testing. Uh, what about the laser life? How many hours? Okay, so this one, the fiber laser, is 100,000 hours. 100,000 hours, oh, okay. So let's say you buy it today and you can use it for the next, let's say working 8 hours per day, can last 15, 20 years, 25 years, depending on the use that you do. It's measuring the, the part, oh, yeah. but not in a traditional way. It's not an, an absolute measurement, it's a, a comparison. Okay. It's comparing the, well, a master part against the, the other parts that you need to measure. Oh, okay. Have you given him any dimensions? Because it kind of knows where the edge is, because it slows down over there. Does yes, it know? Of course. We have programming. Ah, you're going to give it the 3D file, right? file and then we can uh, define the features ah. and uh, prepare an inspection plan here that is going to follow to the go-to points Blame me, I had to do it. The guy was very nice. After he knew I'm working with cars and 3D printing, he gave me a free ball. How nice. All right, we are done with advanced machines. Let's go to the next hall, which is advanced factory. You have to program it manually. So if you want to send, uh, if you want it to send, you may need to uh, follow the points you want to uh, you want to cover with the sender. But also you can uh, it has an adjust adjustable. Thank you. 
I think I have showed you most of the machines, but it was really nice. Alright guys, that's for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video as I did. Thanks for watching and peace out. See you.